You know we're celebrating all dogs on this National Dog Day, but we can't do that without mentioning one dog that's especially close to our hearts, Penguin, our PCL pup. Oh, look how cute. <laughs> we love following his journey to become a canine companion for independence with our weekly pup dates. He is celebrating today by getting some extra belly rubs and treats. And we love him, and those are great pictures. We too, and he's such a cute little puppy. Well, if you have room in your heart and home for a pup, Mikey Hood could have just the dog for you. Yeah, so let's go back to Mikey live at Animal Friends to see oh who our next speed dating dog is. Hey, Mikey. <laughs> Hey guys, we are speed dating this morning at Animal Friends, and I'm back here with Cody. And look, we have a new eligible bachelor here. Cody, who do we have here? This is Tango, and I'm told that he's a really good dancer. I can't verify that. <laughs> but Tango is the perfect dog. If you're looking for a younger, active dog that's still got a ton of spunk and energy, he's only about two years old, and he's a German Shepherd mix. But he was transferred to us by one of our one of our shelter partners, and he's not been here for too too long. But in the very short time that he's been here, he's really won over a lot of our staff and volunteers because he's just a really handsome guy and just loves to meet new people. So he's looking for a family this morning. Yeah, I think he would be really really sweet, but also an excellent guard dog. Absolutely, sure. You know, and I think that he's all bark and no bite because he's a really friendly, sweet guy. But he's got a big dog bark to kind of match that tough guy persona. But once you break through, I think that tough exterior, he's just a big softy. Oh, okay. I, I know he will not be here for long. So if you're looking for a very active dog, maybe some long walks in the park, Tango is the dog for you. So we'll send it back to you, and I'll be back with dog number three in just a bit. Mikey, love it. Tango looks so cute. Mm -hmm. And we are waiting to meet number three just ahead. Yeah, that's coming up. And we want to tell you that Heather and I are excited to be part of Animal Friends annual Black Ties and Tails Gala. Only this year it is done a little bit differently uh, because so many things are different this year. Yeah. Black Tie and Tails is in its 22nd year, but this is the first year that it's going to be a virtual event. It is coming up on September 26th. Yeah, and I was able to take part in this in person two years ago and it's such a fun event to help with the animals there. You'll still be able to take part in auctions. You're also going to hear some great heartwarming stories too. And tickets are on sale right now. We have a link for you so you can get those tickets at PittsburghTodayLive.com.